Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what does your person secretly want to say to you but isn't saying it. Today is the 28th of August, 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 5.56 p.m. Virgo, I'm giving away free personal reading once every 10 days for a lucky winner. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Virgo. If you have commented before, you can do it again. It will increase your chance in winning. And winners will be announced on the community page. Alright, Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and Angels, please show me for Virgo. Virgo's person, what do they secretly want to say to Virgo but isn't saying it? Virgo, I'm using a new microphone, so I hope it sounds good. Let me know in the comment box below. Virgo's person, what do they secretly want to say to Virgo but isn't saying it? Okay. Virgo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and your person. This is a general reading, so... It may or may not resonate with you, and it's not as accurate as a personal reading, so make sure. If you can afford it, book me for a personal reading. Majority of my feedback, if not all, is always very positive, very accurate, okay? Just FYI. Okay, Virgo, let's see. We've got the Six of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So your person secretly wants to say to you that they treasure you, they cherish you, they cherish all the good times both of you have shared with each other. They miss you. Six of Cups could mean that as well. They feel like you are so pure, okay? So pure, so kind, so honest, so positive. The sun. Very positive energy. They make you make them feel happy. You make them see something that they've never seen before. Perhaps it's the Six of Cups. Because the Six of Cups is like very childlike, innocent. You know, children are innocent. So there's something very innocent about you or very childlike about you. Um, it could be the way you look, the way you present yourself or your behavior. I just feel this sense of like they feel like your person secretly wants to say to you that they feel like they can trust they can trust you, okay? Because you are again so innocent, so kind, so positive, will of fortune. But it could also mean a change, okay, Virgo. If they didn't trust you before, uh, they may secretly want to tell to you, tell you that they want to trust you or they trust you more now than before, okay? And just take what resonates with you. If both of you are separated, Virgo, uh, your person may secretly want to tell you that they want to get back together. They want a second chance. Six of Cups could mean that the sun, they want to see you. They want to have a new beginning with you because they're still desiring you. They're still passionate about you. Now, your person could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, strong Leo. I feel like if you're separated, definitely they want a second chance. But maybe they're not saying it because the hangman is right here. Either they that either it's because they feel like they need to make certain sacrifices for these changes to happen or for a reconciliation to happen, or it's because they need more time or that they're giving you some time. Uh, or they're giving themselves some time, some space to, you know, it's like there is no rush kind of an energy, seven of pentacles. They secretly want to say to you that they've been waiting, they've been observing. Now again, Virgo, I see two different groups of you. The first group could be, you know, someone relatively new. Another group could be someone you've known before and that you separated from. Again, just take what resonates, okay? Three of Wands, here is a more first. They secretly want to say to you that they actually haven't turned it back on you yet, okay? Perhaps if there is something else that's coming between the two of you, if there's someone else in the picture, Virgo, they may secretly want to tell, tell you that their connection with the other person has finished or that they are thinking about finishing it, turning their back on this person if there's a third party present that they're not happy. And they may have been looking back on 
their relationship with you where it was much better, happier. Of course, there must have been reasons for a separation, but looking back, it's almost that feeling of like when I look back to our relationship, Actually, there were way more positives than negatives. Perhaps they needed to meet someone else, to be with someone else, or to experience things on their own in order for them to have that clarity, the sun, or to realize that both of you have had really, truly good times together. And also because you've been so kind and nice or you've done a lot of good things for this person, I definitely can see that. Um, if this is somewhere relatively new, Virgo, you open up their eyes. They secretly want to say to you, whoa, I feel very positive about you. I feel very positive about this connection. And I really would like to see where it goes. Will of fortune. Will of fortune also could mean l lucky, a lucky feeling. They may feel lucky that they, he, he or she has met you, that both of you have met each other. Uh, maybe they also could be thinking this could be fate, this could be destiny. Because Wheel of Fortune is also like, you know, like a worldwide, it's it's like that feeling of, of all like gazillion people in the world, you know, how did I get so lucky to have met Virgo? They're happy, they're lucky. This is, I feel like someone new, okay, someone new. But if you're separated, they may also be feeling like lucky that they've met you that you came into their life and if they do have someone else they're turning their back on the other person they secretly also may want to say to you that with a fool perhaps in the future they would actually like to take a chance with you now for the fool actually came out in your last reading but it's in reverse maybe it could be connected to this reading i don't know look uh look at the last uh your last video before this one go uh Click on videos and look for the video before this one, okay? Got the Four of Cups in reverse. Again, Virgo, if this is not happening right now, it could be a prediction, okay? So, Virgo, your person may secretly want to say to you as well that you are a missed opportunity, okay? They missed this opportunity being with you. They missed having like these it's i feel like it's irreplaceable that's the word for it virgo your person feels secretly feels that you are irreplaceable whether it's new or old ex or not be separated they know that you are irreplaceable you are the one and only that they can feel this way for or someone whom has such positive impact in your life or potentially will okay three of cups here is in reverse if you're separated they secretly may want to say to you again that they actually have left someone else okay or thinking about leaving the third party like someone else whoever they could be seeing dating or in a relationship with Interesting, Virgo. But unless roles have been reversed, Virgo, they may secretly want to say to you that, you know, they wonder if you're talking to someone else, if there's someone new, or it could be separated also, it doesn't matter, okay? But because the set of pentacles is like something that is hidden, right? Because the pentacles, these pentacles are hidden in the bush. So they may secretly want to say to you or gain some clarity in regards to if you are talking to someone else, seeing someone else. <clears throat> Excuse me, Virgo. Let's pull up more cards here. Knight of Pentacles, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Now, your person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, uh, strong Leo, any fixed sign, strong Aries, strong Pisces as well. Whatever the case is, six of wands, they secretly want to say to you that they miss you or that they want to see you again. They desire you. They have a lot of passion towards you. They would like to take a new leap of faith with you or take chances with you if there's someone who is new or ch take chances with you again. Six of pentacles, they secretly want to say to you that you've been kind, generous, giving the sun. There's so many positive things that they now see in you. 
things that you've done for them because the hangman perhaps they had some time to think about it right maybe both of you are not really next to each other right now or then maybe there could be a pause a break or a separation doesn't matter but even if you're not separated from this person they still you know they ha they've had some time thinking about you for cups and reverse could mean that they secretly want to say to you that they don't want to miss this opportunity being with you or being with you again, six of wands in love first. Yeah, this very strong message I'm picking up on Virgo. If they have other options, they know the other options aren't as good as you are. And if they, if there's someone, if your person is somebody whom thought the grass is green on the other side, they are going to find out if they haven't yet that the grass is actually not greener on the other side. I just saw one zero one zero one zero zero could mean a new beginning, which the full is number zero as well. That means your person secretly want to say to you that they want to start from zero with you. Uh, it could be starting a new relationship with you if there's someone new or if you're separated, they want to restart, revive this connection with you. They may secretly also want to say to you that they want to commit, but they want to take things slowly with you, or that they're coming towards you very slowly because they would need more time, or that they're giving you some time, or they're just waiting for you, waiting for the right time. All right, Virgo, this is your reading. I hope it serves you well. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, all info is below. Make sure you subscribe. It's free to subscribe, especially if you've been here before. I post your videos very, very often. I make sure that I mention the time and the date in every reading so that you know I don't recycle any of your videos. If I do, by chance, by mistake, sometimes I click on the wrong video let me know in the co uh let me know in the comment box below okay and also feel free to subscribe to my main channel chelsea love tarot and chelsea vlogs chelsea vlogs i just posted a short today so check that one out it's my happy travel channel and my uh chelsea love tarot is my main channel where i would normally go live okay take care Virgo. i hope to see you back here again soon love ya bye